To ready themselves for the Falcons, the Houston Oilers tried every manner of exotic exercise. But no amount of preparation could have had the Oilers ready for what awaited them in Atlanta. Most of the time, the combatants were involved in a football game. On Houston's first series, number 14, starting quarterback Kent Nix tried to find some daylight in the tough Atlanta pass defense. Number 34, strong safety Ray Brown returned the first of his two interceptions, 46 yards, and Atlanta was within scoring range early. Ray Brown's interception was translated into seven points when number 43 Dave Hampton swept to his left and crashed in for the game's first score. Moments after Hampton's touchdown, Kent Nix again tried to bomb the Falcons, this time with play action on third and one. Double O Ken Burrow would have had an easy touchdown, except the entire play was canceled by a penalty. Then Kent Nix's misfortune really multiplied. Claude Humphrey's recovery set up a Falcon field goal and a 10-0 Atlanta lead, but Kent Nix kept firing. Five times the Falcons intercepted, and in the third quarter, Dave Hampton squirmed to another touchdown, the lead 20 to three. With the game almost out of reach, Dante Pastorini brought his injured ribs into the game and fired long for Ken Burrow. Burrow's 48-yard play set up a Houston touchdown, scored by dashing Dante Pastorini himself. The Falcons held off Pastorini and the Oilers for the rest of the game and found themselves in first place and ready for this week's showdown with the 49ers in San Francisco.